Greetings, it's Maxo Diddly, and today I am going to be showing you how to rename a file in C++. So let's get right into it. Firstly, make sure you include IOStream and CStudio at the top of your code because we'll be needing them for this tutorial. So we're going to be creating a function. We're going to do void rename file const std string reference old file name and const std string reference new file name. So we don't need to return a value. The function will be called rename file. So the first string is going to be the file that we want to rename. And the second string is going to be what we want to change the name of the old file to. Then we've got a little bit of code. So we're going to do if std rename old file dot c underscore str and new file dot c underscore str is not equal to zero. If it's not equal to zero, then we do error renaming file. Otherwise, we do file renamed successfully. And by do, I mean print this out to the screen. So this line here, that's inside VF statement. It's going to call the std rename function from the CStudio library, and this function just renames a file. However, it takes in C style strings. So what we do is we take our normal string and convert it to a C string. And we can do that using the C underscore str function. So we're passing in our two strings, the file that we want to rename and what we want to rename it to. And we're converting those strings to C strings. And then this function can try and rename the file. If something goes wrong and it can't rename the file, then this line, this bit of code here is going to return a number that's not zero. So we can then tell the user something went wrong with renaming the file. However, if this returns a zero after it tries to rename the file, that means it renamed the file successfully. Therefore, we can print to the user that the file was renamed successfully. And that's basically it for this tutorial. So in the main method, we do rename file, we put in the file path that we want to change the name of, and then we do the new file name that we want to give it. So if you're in Visual Studio, you can right click on your folder and go to open folder in File Explorer. This is going to be where I'm going to have my text file that I want to rename. You can put this wherever you want, just make sure you get the file path correct. But if it's in this folder, I can just do the file name for the file path because it's relative to the C++ file. With all of that, save your work and hit play. File renamed successfully. That is a good sign. And if we look back, our file to rename.txt is now something.txt. So thanks for being a great audience. Be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed and subscribe for more C++ tutorials. Thanks for watching.